Western truckload is they continue to have the challenges, right? So we've got uh, COVID is still running rampant. So we've got labor issues. Uh, we've got productivity issues and volumes remain ele elevated, right? Consumer buying patterns haven't shifted. Um, so terminals are overflowing uh, right now. And, you know, in talking to some of these carriers, and this is in the market report as well, you know, the, for the first time, carriers are coming back and say, for the first time ever, we're actually flying employees from their home location to other terminals that are struggling. You know, before uh, they may, you know, end up driving over to a different terminal, but they're actually flying employees. We are seeing driving schools being reopened, which is a good thing. Uh, just getting more drivers on the road, that's, that's obviously healthy. One company we talked to, they hired 6,100 drivers in 2020, and they said that's not even a fraction of what we need. Um, so as more driving schools open up, you know, there's a residual impact of having more drivers there. The big focus on pay uh, to try to attract more drivers into the industry, uh, but overall LTL performance continues to be, uh, you know, kind of questionable, a little bit strained, uh, and it's definitely presenting challenges for shippers and receivers out there.